guys, it's me, Meaner. Here we are at the Go Rock Squad secret base. So let's go ahead and head in here and see what happens. If you touch one of these red panels... What? 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 What are you doing here? Intruders aren't allowed. Stick into our base, will you? Out you go. So yeah, you will get pushed out every single time you get detected with one of those red panels. So you have to be careful. Basically, just when it's light, go across it. When it's red, don't. Red means stop. You know your you know your science kids. Anyway, let's go in here. And uh, this doesn't look fun. It looks a lot harder than it actually is. In fact, if you look very closely, you'll see that the pattern isn't random. You'll see that these little things actually go around kind of like a snake. So you have to actually follow its pattern and actually go across that way. So it's actually quite simple, a lot easier than it actually would be from first appearance. Just wait for it and go across. So yeah, very simple once you learn the pattern, but otherwise it's a complete and utter pain if you don't know what you're doing. So, yeah. That one there is a bit tricky, I must admit. That one there you have to actually, you can't just like walk into it. You have to actually kind of walk across and actually skip ahead of it. But this one's just as simple. Let's go on here. Head on here. Head over to the left. Head up. And there you go. Then for this one here. Over here. Over there. Up here. Over there. And voila! We are done. That's it. That light puzzle is a lot more annoying if you don't know what you're doing. If you go past here, you'll be locked in and you'll see teleportation panels. I wonder what games you might have seen these in before. Take the left one, you'll see a Mankey and you'll see some, uh, did we catch the Mankey yet? Yeah, we did, obviously, several times. But we did not catch that Ralts. We want to try catching that Ralts whenever we can. Let's catch these things just to get them out of the way. Just so we don't have to worry about them, we can only worry about their Ralts. Caught that, and we caught that. Alright, so there we go. And now you have a magnetonic case we need to restore our health. But let's see if we can find that Ralts. Where'd you go, Ralts? Where'd you go? Hmm. Ralts is somewhat annoying to catch. Let's just kind of head back here. I want to keep on trying to capture it. Aha! Teleported right into me, jerk. That didn't take long at all. Normally, it could take ages to try and catch that thing. Like, it keeps on teleporting out of the way almost immediately. But, I caught it. That's the main thing. Let's head in here now. Head over here to the left. And we have a Gorok Squad member. Hey, it's you again. You remember me, don't you? You don't remember? You really don't remember again? God, I'm not taking that. You have some personal problems, man. I'm just gonna catch these all really quickly right in the back. I don't really have to, but either way. Fine, I'll do it this way. And then I'll just catch you afterwards. There we go. Went ahead and got some experience points there. Not too many, but I got something. I guess that counts. God, don't ever forget this. Please remember me next time. Now, I'm actually going to be trying to go to all the panels here. If you go down, there's actually a Swampert there. There are actually a lot of Pokemon we could catch if we don't be if we don't beat this too early. Now, for this one, you pretty much have to just do this for the strategy in order to actually beat it. But we caught it, so there you go. And we have two in our partner gauge, so that's always a win as well. Three water, okay. Head in here. Take this panel. I'm actually just randomly going where I want to. I don't actually don't remember the pattern or which way I'm supposed to go. But here's the Blaziken. I have a slight idea of how to capture all these Pokemon. But if I mess up in my maze trying to capture these guys, please don't blame me. It's kind of hard to judge. Darn it. Come on. Keeps on breaking free, jerk. Wait for it. Dang it. I will catch you.
Fine, fine, I'll use my little partner here. Better yet, I'll use my Mankey for the fighting assist. Perfect, there we go. I didn't have to waste Pichu's partner gauge, and Mankey's not going to be too big of a deal anyway later, so don't have to worry about that. Did he go left or right? I'm pretty sure I went left. So let's go this way. And you'll see three panels here. You want to take the one to the left to actually get out of here. But I'm going to go up instead. Take the middle one. You'll see this guy with two Mankeys. Fwahahaha! <laughs> Finally! Finally our time has come! Our new Styler is finished! Using that outrageous new Styler, the Gorak Squad can now capture any Pokemon whether they like it or not. Every Pokemon in the world will now do our every bidding! And that gra Graveler just came out of nowhere. Golem! Wow, that's... Messing up Golem's name, too. I'm trying to capture the Mankey first, since they're clearly less of a threat than the Golem. But, uh, either way, the Golem could be troublesome to actually capture them. Alright, so I caught the Mankey. How about this Mankey? Alright, caught that. Now it's just the Golem here. Perfect. Alright. That wasn't too big of a problem. I, I'm not suited for the field of battle. I will withdraw into my lab and concentrate on creating the perfect system. All right, let's see. There's a there's an actual uh, elective elective buzz. I almost said elective fire. That doesn't exist in this generation. But this guy is actually a full heal here. He actually recharges your Styler to full whenever you need it. So that's always a nice thing there. See, three electric. All right, so let's head over. Let's take this panel here. Ah, yes, this is where I wanted to go. You're going to lose, you know. The headquarters assign us with terif terrifically tough Pokemon. Yeah, look at those. They look they look super tough. Just look at those scariness on them. I can feel the the scare. Yeah, look at that. Uh, that was a tough capture, man. I was... I was just struggling, trying to, eh, whatever. I wish they'd assign us tougher Pokemon. Might as well have given you Magikarps, honestly. Maybe would've actually been more dangerous. Anyway, heading over here to the right. We end up back here again. I think we looped around all the way, if I'm not mistaken. All right, so let's take this. And actually had to take this little place here we were at before. Go to the left. End up here. Now there's a left and a right. I believe you want to go right if you don't want to you think left is the way you're supposed to go. Up, oh, nope, nope, this is the way you're supposed to go right here. So don't go in here yet. So let's go over to the left and see if there's anything I missed. Yep. What? Intruders here? Where did you get in? I'll make you pay for trying to meddle with our experiments. So we actually have a Matang here too. Alright. Let's go ahead and get our little mine in here to just shock these things. I'm gonna catch the Beldum first. And then the Matang. Perfect. Caught them all in one go with the, in the same shock charge. Alright, that works. Failure leads to success. The data from our loss will be used to our benefit somehow. I highly doubt that, but okay. Anyway, let's head over to the right. Anything down here? Nope. Just head inside these stairs. And we'll see a gate here that's blocked off and needs two cutter. We didn't catch anything that needs two cutter, so... Huh. Let's just head down here and see what we get. Hey, look, a Croconaw. Did we catch one of these yet? I'm pretty sure we have, actually. Actually, yeah, I'm, I'm positive we caught one of these already. We never caught a Feraligator, though, I don't believe. Alright, and then over here, there's a Graveler. If you want to wake it up, you can. I don't know why you need one. No, it's just going to pop itself up anyway. And we can catch it that way. No need to waste a water Pokemon for this. 
No real need to grab this. It can prove useful, maybe. No real necessarily need to. But, either way. In fact, let's get rid of that Ralts. That Ralts is of no use to anyone right now. And maybe I'll go ahead and just recharge my Styler as well with the Magneton. There we go. All is good. Let's head down here. Hi, Meteors. I was looking for you. I was ordered to assist your mission. But you know what? I would have come even if I wasn't ordered. <laughs> uh, okay. Hey, look at Taylor. Maybe maybe it's that one guy's Taylor again. Larry's Taylor, I believe. Anyway, Sneasel is the one we actually need to actually catch, of course. Can I catch without a Pokey Assist? I know I could do it. Dang it. Haha! -ha. Take that, Sneasel. Alright, so we head back out here. Head up. Take our little Sneasel here. And break this down. Alright, what's up ahead here? There's another like the buzz in case you need it. Ah, yes, it's this part. You know what? This has been kind of a short episode, but I actually want to save this part for next time. This is part where things get really fun, and I think this should be its own part, honestly. So next time, Pokemon Ranger will be heading off and finishing up the Gorak Squad secret base and see what trials await us. See you guys then. And I'm also going to be looking on the lookout as well to see if I can find anything else that I missed. So, uh, yeah. Unless I find something else, see you next time. Alright, it's a good thing I checked because I actually did miss something here. If you take this little panel here where that guy is standing, take this one. I missed this one. Head down. You'll see this lady here with three Pokemon. What? Why is there a Ranger here? The, they're Garak Squad's Pokemon. Clearly, obviously. Poke Assist time. I'm gonna bother. Just Poke Assist it. Alright, caught that one. Try to capture Scyther by itself, since it's gonna be most annoying. Caught it. Alright. So I'll just leave his hair across here. Perfect. Alright, so I caught that as well. Ugh, this means more demerit points. I am in so much trouble. Alright, so heading over here. Head up around. Well, see this guy. I don't like the looks of you. What's the password? What's that? Find the toenail clippers. W w what are you going on about? Zubat and a Swalot. Alright. You know what? Let's give you these Golbat really easily here. Zubat, rather. Alright, caught those. Caught that. Now all that's left is the Swalot, which isn't really going to be that big of a deal. There we go. That's pretty much that. What you said about my toenails, that made me f all self-conscious, so I couldn't concentrate. Haha, <laughs> jerk. Anyway, head over here in this portal. And you get on this side of where that Ralts was. And this is where, if you notice this path here, if you went this way, this is actually where you started. See, I went to the left and I completely forgot to check what's over to the right. So that's what happened there. So yeah. Next time, Pokemon Ranger will be heading on and finishing up the secret base for real. See you guys then.